to be inspired. What inspires you? How do you maintain a state of inspiration? I came up the mountain here to get some inspiration, to answer a question. And that question was, where to begin? Where to begin this series of videos? You see, I took on a challenge to do 30 videos in 30 days. And it's a huge challenge, so I wasn't quite sure where to start. And I came where I always come when I need inspiration, and that's up this mountain. Let me share some of the view with you now. The sun setting, there's this beautiful kind of wispy cloud in the sky, and there's not a soul around. There's the lake spreading out in front of me, and I feel the expanse, and I feel the perspective. I feel the sense of this whole big picture and ideas start flooding in. It's up here that I got the inspiration for a course that I created just a year ago. It's here that every time inspiration for whatever it is that I'm working on, it always comes on demand. It, it's like, it's just waiting for me to receive it. It feels like I'm going on some sort of walkabout each time I come out here up the mountain. And I just open myself for inspiration. I have a few processes that I do, and I'll share those with you in other videos. But I really knew that I was being guided to a particular place where I would sit and just survey the view of the lake and also my life. And I was drawn up here too because it's here that every time inspiration for whatever it is that I'm working on it always comes on demand it, it's like it's just waiting for me to receive it where do you go to be inspired what inspires you how do you maintain a state of inspiration <laughs>